we're seeing now the first time people coming off of centralized cloud to a better, faster, more secure, unstoppable, unhackable alternative. If we see some doing it, I think all of them are going to want to do it, given enough time. To make a meme out of this describes the crypto cloud project, the blockchain cloud. It's the embodiment of Web3 itself. Right, exactly. What do you mean? From token ledgers to decentralized cloud compute. Right, right. And when you speak to developers, they always wind up asking the question, but how much of Amazon Web Services do you rely on? And when you let them know that there's absolutely no reliance, it's a really tough pill for people to swallow with 20 years working in big tech cloud. So this is something that you get it once you get it. And once you see it, you can't unsee it. And this is going to be the playbook for 2025 to 2030, in my opinion. I think Ghost is, might do okay. I think EXE could do okay. But cloud, I think, is truly in a category of its own as soon tens of thousands of people start to realize it. And then hundreds of thousands of people start to realize and then a million people. But looking at the space right now, I would say maybe one out of 100 crypto investors might understand what we're talking about today. Yeah. What do you think? Like I envision cloud as being a unifying force within the eco. Mm -hmm. All of us believe in ICP. Right. And cloud literally represents all of what ICP is in a meme form, you know? And so how do we get the whole eco to just recognize that without feeling like it's a threat to their other meme coins? Now, people inside the community, it is player versus player. I don't, I don't love that, but I guess it is. And I don't know why it is the way it is, but I do know that people like you and me that have finally seen behind the curtain so to speak it's like this thing lines up with the underlying thesis for the entire for the next five years basically so in my opinion cloud is going to live rent free on icp for the next five years i mean i'm not saying it's not going to go down but i don't think it's going to go to zero i think we're you know? at the bottom bro <laughs> I kind of agree. I tend to agree. I think everyone who wanted to take profits on it took them. Right. Yeah, and exactly. Now it's just those who believe in it. Like to disprove the cloud, you'd have to you'd have to smash the entire ICP thesis. Yep. That's yep. it. That's it. That's it. They're one and the same. Right, exactly. I think that the meme coin tribalism is in in full force people have bag bias towards the, the memes that they felt attracted to. And so they're not even, they have blinders on to what cloud means and represents. And a lot of people like hated on Bobby for pumping it because he's been such a straight shooter and like straight away from the memes until now, which should be a testament to the project itself like that he would right. choose one project to back you know because it's the only one that has real meaning and like with the other coins like I'm, i don't want to shit on any meme coin but like what do they mean right exactly <laughs> do they mean yeah. anything you know or is it just funny is it just like and and that's yeah. valuable humor is valuable don't get me wrong but i get it though i do get it because like i missed initially and i was like when you miss on something big, you get tired of seeing it in your face, like thrown in your face. And like, what's the incentive to support it if you don't, if you're not yeah. a part of it. And for me, it was, well, Bobby's talking about this and I just, I get it, you know? So like I missed the boat, but I'm still going to believe and support. And like, I started, yeah. I started attaching the cloud before I owned any to my too, like too. silly videos, just because I knew it was the I truth. I had no cloud. <laughs> I swear I had no cloud. Same. I just wanted it to go up because it was getting like it had gone up 100x. I was like, well, if it goes up another 100x, people will have to talk about this. Mm -hmm. 
it, it it'll have to it'll be it'll, it'll be too big not to have the conversation at that point. I'm in it to get to the conversation. At some point, if it hits five hundred million dollars, there will be a conversation about it. You know, well, it's the same conversation for ICP. So it's like I just want to get to the conversation. You know where everybody's having it. It's Jim Cramer is on CNBC talking about it. Like, yep. I don't know if these are the lows of the year on ICP. Um, Ten dollars. I mean, I was out on my patio three, four months ago, just letting it rip, talking about a parabolic blow off top into the multiple hundreds of dollars. Yep. And I'm. And I'm I'm gonna head back out on the patio, <laughs> and I'm gonna pump the shit out of ICP, bro. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, man. Once this narrative hits the mainstream, it's gonna be too late. And that's why I said strike yeah. while strike while the iron is cold. Understand? Don't wait till it's hot. By the time it gets hot, you're gonna burn yourself. So. Strike while the iron is cold, and it's cold right now. So, bars. Yeah.